Hi guys, this morning we're on our way to London for a little mini break. I often get asked whether I worry about diet while I'm away or working out or tracking calories and the short answer is no. So I thought I would take you with me for the next couple of days and show you what I get up to, the food that I eat and why I will always put happiness, making memories and spending time with friends first. Holiday or no holiday. But first stop is Heathrow to pick up my boyfriend. just checked in so I thought I'd really quickly show you guys the room. We're staying at a place called Artist Resident. It's just like a little simple room but it's really nice and then really nice big window, mirror, yeah, <laughs> and then this is the bathroom. But yeah, it's really sunny today. Also look over here, I've just noticed this and it's so cute. Number one, this is just like the little tea station, but they're so pretty. And then down here, they have like the slippers, a hairdryer, I don't actually know what this is, adapters and, oh, they've got adapters and chargers here, Kenny. Right guys, we have literally just been in the room for like two hours. Kenny's been having a nap because he's obviously straight off his flight from Q8. And now we've got ready and we're gonna go out and have a drink, have some snacks, and then we're gonna get dinner. So, I mean, I literally put this on Instagram like yesterday and said I'd be wearing it the entire time and it was not a lie. So I'm just wearing this little like beige, really lightweight suit and then, but this is like a little um, sleeveless knitted vest thing. And then some new trainers, which I really, really like. But yeah, and then obviously a pair of gold hoops because you cannot go to dinner without gold hoops in. But I literally will be living in this outfit because it is so comfy and it's just, you don't even have to think about it. You just throw it on. That's Kenny is in the bathroom brushing his teeth. <laughs> yeah. And that's pretty much that. So when we get to wherever we're gonna have a drink and a snack, I will show you guys what we're having. I'm literally starving. So hungry. Little cute ears. We're just waiting for an Uber. Are you excited to be with me? No. That's nice, isn't it? This is our idea of a snack before dinner. Kenny's ordered a whole load of like chips, really. They're not really fries, are they? And then these are, what are they? Cauliflower buffalo. Cauliflower wings. Cauliflower wings. They look really good. They kind of look like meatballs, don't they? We had this one at home with my, I mean, with my mum. That was really good. Look, guys, these say super food on them. Then they've got a protein one and a curl one. honestly don't judge us but somehow we've ended up back in bed as you guys saw we went to whole food we were just sat in this bar having a beer and kenny just looked at me and he was like mm, but we could go back to the hotel and have a cup of tea and watch tv and have snacks in bed we're both just so tired tomorrow we've got a way more full-on day we're like meeting friends for dinner and stuff but anyway for now let's do a whole foods haul because we've got some really good stuff okay so first things first 
Kenny bought these Italian little bread crisp things. Nine pounds, guys. I don't know how or why, but nine pounds, fine. Kenny wanted them. Then we got some of these, which I've never had before. They're like tortilla chips, but they're superfood tortilla chips, organic. They look really good, so we're trying them. To go with those two, we got some of this Moorish hummus, which I always get. But we're trying the lemon and dill one today. So that's a bit new and exciting. We got some, what is this? Like olive tapenade. I think it's some olive tapenade, which looks really, really good. Again, just to go with these two. So I got some quinoa with chickpeas and tomatoes, just because I probably need some actual real food, not just crisps. We got some mixed nuts with this giant corn stuff. Literally obsessed with giant corn. So that looks really, really yummy. And then sweet stuff. Kenny got these little banana and date flapjack bites, which are vegan and look really good. So I will report back. We got one of these Love Raw bars because both of us love these. And then for some reason, Kenny got some kind of beer. So that is our dinner this evening. I don't know if it's the healthiest, but I don't feel like it's the worst, you know, for like a hotel room dinner. I'm actually so excited to try some of this. Football. In the state of this, <laughs> not, <Awesome. laughs> not a chance. They've got really nice organic little teas here as well, which you guys know is a bit of me. <laughs> this um, quinoa chickpea and sun-dried tomato pot from Whole Foods is actually really good. So if you ever need something on the go, highly recommend. Guys, if you weren't already sold on how cute this hotel is, look at the slippers. I love them. These are definitely coming home with me. Good morning, guys. Yes, my hair is tied up in a face mask still. If that's not innovation, I literally don't know what is. We honestly had the nicest night ever last night. I, ch I literally cannot recommend this hotel enough. They've just literally thought of like every single detail, like just everything from the slippers, the products in the bathroom, the little teapot and stuff. It's just honestly, it's the radio. It's such a good hotel. Anyway, we had the nicest night last night, but obviously really chilled. And then today we're just going to just do some exploring, do some shopping, obviously do lots of eating. So this is me for the day. Obviously I will take this hair mask out of my hair. Obviously I'm gonna have to do my makeup for dinner later. And I don't know what kind of person has it in them to do a full face twice in one day. But that girl is not me. So I've just got, I've done my eyebrows and I've just put a bit of concealer and a bit of lip balm on and that is me for the day. Obviously I'm gonna get changed now and then I think we're gonna go find some breakfast. So I'll take you guys with us. to bring some soya milk to the room because obviously I need it for my tea and stuff. And is this not the most adorable little thing that they've bought in? It's like a little ceramic milk carton. So cute. Oh, is that a fridge in there? Yeah. It's a fridge, yeah. yeah. that's really cool. So this is the fridge in the cupboard. I showed you guys this roughly, but bathroom is really, really nice. We have like our robes and slippers and stuff here. 
all the little amenities and things that you need. Big mirrors, yes, I'm wearing the same outfit again today. Don't judge me, it's raining. And it's like the only thing I have. So I'll change for dinner tonight, I promise. This is like such a nice detail in the room. Nice big bed, really cool little things next to the bed. This is for like uh, doorbell and stuff, turn down service and things like that. So that's really nice. It's like already the middle of the day and we still haven't managed to get any breakfast yet. So I'm just snacking on the stuff we had left over from last night. Right, we've got very exciting news. We've just booked the Plants by Deliciously Ella restaurant, the new one, for lunch now. So we're about to run, jump on a tube and head over there. So obviously, I will show you guys everything that we eat and I'll let you guys know if it's good. I'm really hoping it's good because you guys know I literally like listen to her podcast, read her recipe books, think that her whole vibe and like attitude towards food is great. So really hoping for good things, but yeah, really exciting. Are you, are you excited, Kenny? I'm a very harsh critic. Critic with a T on the end. Critic. <laughs> You, you can let everyone know then, can't you? If, they, if it passes your approval. I love you. I love you. <laughs> we just came to have a look at the rooftop bar in our hotel. It's so nice. It's such a shame because yesterday it was literally so sunny. And today it's kind of rainy, but it's still, honestly, so nice. <laughs> mushroom scallops, the charred baby jam Caesar salad, the three sliders which look really good, bean and kimchi, blah blah blah, and the grilled cabbage. I really wanted the mac and cheese but they sold out. And she said that like all the um, dishes are for sharing. So this is the mushroom scallops and this is the Caesar salad which looks so good. It's really yummy. Cute, so it's when they give you the bill, they also give you these, which I've had before and they taste so good. So guys, obviously we're back at the hotel and I've just got ready for dinner. This is honestly the dressiest I've been for literally about 12 months. So I'm just wearing this midi bodycon dress it was sent to me by white fox it's such such a gorgeous dress and then i just have i don't know if you can see these little like knee-high boots on but yeah so that is me ready for dinner um i literally never wear dresses either so i feel like really weird wearing this we're going to novikov which to be honest i do not think is that vegan friendly but i'll make it work because everybody else wants to go there so i will show you guys what i end up eating fingers crossed there's enough options for me i need to take a break i scroll through my phone just to escape but won't this ever change I keep comparing my life with my mates And it's all strange My sanity's based on realities that I so Hey guys, so we just got back to the room. We actually did try to go for a drink after dinner, but literally because of COVID, everything is just like so much effort trying to get into somewhere, so. But in the morning, we're going to this brunch place that I really, really like. I've been there once before and I've literally remembered it for like three years since I went there, so. I will see you guys in the morning. dressed packed up all of our stuff because we're going home today it's really rainy today so i'm literally just wearing gym leggings trainers i really wish i had a change of shoes not these white ones but we roll with it then this little brandy melville top and this which i recently got from zara and i really like because it's really lightweight for summer anyway my hair's a mess but we're about to go i think i said last night but we're about to go to this brunch place that i really love and I will see you guys when we get there. This hotel, by the way, has been so nice as well. Like a different vibe to the last one, but literally so nice. So if you need to be more like central, east 
type of vibes and could not recommend this hotel enough. Right, let's go and get some breakfast because I am hungry. <laughs> salad, a little bit of cauliflower and a little bit of broccoli. And then in yours, courgette salad, some sweet potato, and then spinach and tofu. Hey guys, so we didn't actually end up going where I thought we were gonna go for breakfast because the menu had changed and it just wasn't what we fancied. But where we did end up going was so good anyway. We just checked out of the hotel, we're back in the car and we've got like a five hour journey home. I really, really hope you guys enjoy seeing just what we got up to over the last couple of days and more importantly, what we eat and all the good food places in London. Next week, I think I'm gonna film a week of workouts just because that's something that you guys have asked for. So that'll be coming next week. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next one.